Another of those really tough ones where you were forced to make quite a lot of changes today. Ah, it's not an excuse though. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to look for excuses with the, the injuries. Obviously that, that is having an effect on us, but we still had 11 guys in the pitch today that I felt should have done better. And I'm, I'm, no, I'm not aiming that every day. I think there was two or three of the more senior ones that always pre- performed for us, but I just I don't wow. think there was enough there for the rest of them. And, it's hard to take because we were for 24, 25 minutes until we get the first goal, we're well in it. But again, you can't just play the game for 25 minutes and expect to get results. So at the end up, we got we get turned over quite easily in the end up, which is disappointing. Um, of the youngsters that came on, was there anyone that impressed you? Today, no. Not at all. I don't think, I don't think any of them done enough. Uh, I thought, to be fair, Peter McGill came on at half-time and, and at least got about and put a few tackles in and was busy. But for, I'm, I'm not just wanting to single out younger ones, but I just there's there's enough of them in there. They know that we're not happy with their performance. They need more, uh, and the younger ones have probably got to learn for this more than the older ones to go and progress in their careers and hopefully go up the ladder. Because if they don't, if they kind of come out and play nights like this and enjoy it and show that desire, and they get that wee bit of fire again, uh, and they're not progressing the game. And again, I'm just so disappointed in how they performed tonight. So what was it turned out? I know it was Liam Buchanan again getting in behind us and getting that goal because, as you said, up to then we were pretty comfortable and possibly running the match. Was it? Is it a lack of confidence just now, the head's down? Well, we don't, the first goal we actually don't defend, right? We just, uh, the defending was pretty weak. Uh, Liam just basically gets in and it's an easy finish and end up. Uh, and a couple of the other goals, is, is we need to do a lot better. Uh, I'm just I'm so so annoyed and so disappointed that we've, we've basically went out the cup with well whimper the night and I, I I can't have that as I say as a player I never ever ever was like that I always wanted to do my best and even if I didn't play well I'd still work hard and I felt we didn't have enough of that night. So what do we do for Saturday? Peter Head as they showed up there are no mugs whatsoever so you're in a in for a really tough one. It's the matter how we play. No, there's there's nobody any mugs out there. We've got to. We're going to do a lot better than we've done the night. We've got a, hopefully we'll have two or three of the boys back for injury, but when it you went see, see we're going to train, we've got another two or three in there that's injured again, so we're, we've not got our troubles to see it that way. But see, I just need to get 11 guys in the pitch that, that want to win games for United and, and stop this bad run of former on, hopefully get a result and start maybe change things. You said you were looking everywhere for players. Has there been anything in that way at all? It's two or three things that we've, we've tried this week. Obviously, we couldn't do anything for the cup game tonight, but trying for the weekend, and they fell through, and it's frustrating because you, you definitely see we need a couple of other bodies there. And uh, but we'll keep trying. It's only, it's only Tuesday. We've still got a few more days to go before Saturday, so we'll see what we can do.